What, why do you think um, you know, your brand popped off, I guess? Because like, you know. it's sick. Spent the morning with Air One testing the juice that we're going to do as a collaboration, which we will launch when we launch the store over in LA. Um, it's just something that I wanted to do because it made sense for us because we eat a lot there. Um, I believe in health and fitness and wellness, and I'm always promoting different types of fruit and things that I can use as pre and post workout and stuff like that. So I wanted to make a smoothie with these guys because they're the best in the world at this stuff. And <laughs> we are headed to Air One to get the final samples of the smoothie that we've been cooking up for the past few months. It launches on Friday, today is Wednesday, so we're just going to go and get some content of it. <sighs> Done it again. I buy, I buy all your stuff, it's yeah. so sick. I'm no, I mean, not right now, but yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. But I think, I did, I find the brand so sick. What are you doing? So, uh, yeah. Oh, baby. That looks good. Yeah. It's just a perfect elixir to uh, energize the body for the whole day. Secret sauces in here, mainly mangoes. Consistency is perfect to be fair. This is the mango storm. Most of it is actually straight up mango. Coconut water, raw milk, organic dates, some raw honey, cordyceps powder in it and ashwagandha, but then it's got Himalayan pink salt sprinkled in it as well. It's got like a really thick consistency through the mango and the coconut, but then the salt and the ashwagandha kind of dries it out so it's like not it's not too like wet tasting so it's really good it's thick it's like a, it's more like an ice cream than a smoothie isn't it yeah so it's better than chick-fil-a <laughs> You just get tickets for uh, George, Alex, Caesar, and you need. Yeah. Just calling me. Department. Probably one of George's fucking appointments. What's up, boys? You want to do a pit check? Starting off with the ski boots. I don't know what brand they are. Nordica, bro. Nordica. We got the 247 ski mission pant above with the little card holder here. We got that zip at the bottom. So you can put it over your ski boot. A couple of accessories dangling off here. We got all the zip pockets ready for all your ski shit. Then we're going with the insulated 247 jacket. The other boys have got the mission jacket on, but I thought I'd go a little bit different today. Has a special puzzle on the arm just for your actual ski ski. Coming up, we got one of Ross's little uh, snoods on. Don't know what brand this is because we sold out of the represent ones. Then under the thermal gloves, we've got the 247 gloves. I'm not going to pull that off because I can't be asked. 247 beanie and then the Will Gooch sunglasses. <laughs> Will Gooch sunglasses. Sauce is still crap. I'm so tired after two, two, two runs. Yeah, three hours done, bro. Three hours, the whole thing is over. We so got a lot of runs. We were first up the mountain. Yeah. Okay. Took a little nap. Took a nap, run a 10k tonight. And then back to the bodybuilding tomorrow. <laughs> Get a lot of that, big boys. <laughs> That's all for me. Yeah. Starters. Main dessert. <laughs> Go on, grab one. Extra lunch. 
where the headphones are going to tune out any minute now. Always get nervous leading into these things and then within like five minutes it's absolutely fine. And I think why I've been nervous for the past few days. But I've done my research for this one and I've done it plenty of times so it should be sweet. Is that 8721? Yeah. Yesterday was one, today's one. Then from tomorrow onwards it's two. <laughs> um, but yeah, welcome to our kind of pop up. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, brother. How are you? Good to see you. It's been a long time, I know. How are you? I think at the time, our team was telling me you had like eight employees the first time we spoke. Yeah. Which is crazy. What, what is that crazy. Yeah, and you were like in a, a back room at the uh, my yeah. old office. Mad. What a time. One inside. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I like coming out here. Yeah. It's difficult to live here, but I like we like coming out here. That's the kind of thing that like gives me chills watching it. Like we can do that in fact. How long have you been videoing now? That's about a year. Yeah. 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 Like like the sunrise because I wake up and I'm on, I'm on calls from four a.m. Oh shit, yeah. So like seeing that sunrise is. What is the mission that you're on? Yeah, it's quite a big, it's, well, big business. It's a seven-figure business, but it's, it's wow. like an accessory of the show. So that's so sad. Yeah, very much. We're gonna try Thank and um, incorporate a lot of um, B-roll stuff, aren't we? That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like, okay, so you don't want to talk, then? Like, why are you? Just getting the eyeball up. So yeah, yeah, yeah. You can tell, like, you you're like kind of jab sometimes. Yeah, I can yeah tell I'm, you trying to, I'm trying to find the answer. I, genuinely, it's because I want to know something. Yeah, yeah. And if I don't, I try not to move on until I know that I know it. Because I know the viewers sat at home also probably wondering the same thing. How was that? Great, man. Really enjoyed it. Got a little bit hot during it, but <laughs> when the girlfriend the questions come up, <laughs> oh, wow. people don't know. But we can always tell when someone's uncomfortable because the arms go up. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you watch it, watch when your arms go up because I'm always looking at. Okay. <laughs> Man, I mean the rest is history, isn't it? Yeah. It's part of your story now, which is incredible. Yeah. All right, look, let's go. Bedtime. Yeah, nice one. Just put these shorts, John. Just those shorts. Yeah. Yeah. Why are you shooting in here today, George? We are shooting, Eat. not allowed to say, uh, men's health cover uh, for the March issue, so it'll come out in February. So probably after this video, so we might have to beat that out. Um, it's fucking freezing, I need to get a pump on, I need to get warm, because I've got all the topless pick. I've been dieting for five weeks for this, so hopefully it'll look okay. Had no water for the past 24 hours as well. Should be fun. Excited to get it done with though. I want to eat again tonight and then get back to proper training. That's all I've done every day for the past uh, five weeks. So the biceps have gone from 16 to 24 inches. <laughs> See Big stretch from the chest, there we go. Just make sure we get these oil and up shots in there. Uh... This is the tannin. Don't you send those Just lost the bottle a little bit when it goes in against that buck, and the ones from yeah, I love those. Just one second for me. Okay, thank you. In action. <laughs> hey,
All right, we just got the Men's Health magazine from the UK team. Limited edition cover that comes with like the first, was it 4,000? Yeah. Uh, inside it has the shoot from Lone Pine, which that's probably one of my fucking favorite shots from this guy behind the camera right now. And it also has a little link to a discount code on that. Um, and this is the cover. Looks pretty sick, not gonna lie. At first I thought it was a bit weird, but we only had a few weeks to prepare for it, but yeah, it's pretty cool. There's a five page spread in here about my life with fitness and how we built it into represent and what 247 is about, so that's pretty good. And then there's a full page spread from David, which is the editor from when we went and ate some steak in London and chatted about all things 247 and what's coming, so yeah. I'm happy with it. Well, hold on. We're even going to use this reference while I'm here. Awesome. Ryan. Right. Um, we've been talking about it for almost two years, I think. But I think also a lot of pressure of people who expect a lot from us. You know, we've, yeah. we both launched businesses before. You know, the levels and expectations are there. And we take uh, nothing for granted. We're excited for sure. How do you feel, George? It's been a journey, and it's not even started yet. But I'm super excited, and like Ross said, like you've got to remind yourself we've got a lot of resource behind us and a lot of years' experience. So we kind of, I guess, we feel like we know what we're doing, and I know we we still don't, but we've got that behind us to really give us a get go. Why so much salt? Yeah, so first product is citrus flavor, uh, electrolyte hydration in 250 ml can, jam packed full of electrolytes. You know, it's like nothing else on the market. 500 milligrams of sodium, potassium, magnesium. I drink it in the morning first thing, you know, for a coffee, before I train, before I go to work. You know, it is, it is for elite athletes, but it's also for everybody. And uh, zero sugar, uh, zero artificial ingredients. That's exactly what it is. Yeah. That was fine. That, yeah. Like, do you know who this guy is? He's moved out to my life. I looked on his Instagram and I was like, this looks pretty cool. <laughs> was that me? Was that like uh, the time in the showroom? Chris is. Yeah, Chris yeah, it was a Chris brand. Remember that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was coming out to LA, so I messaged Ross, I was like, you want to train? Because he obviously trains CrossFit. And at the time, he was like, yeah, let's, let's train, let's uh, sauna, ice bath, do everything. We went and did a little CrossFit session, and like, we were literally like head to head with everything we were doing. So I was like, fucking, yes, I found someone here that I can train with. And Ross was talking about building a brand then, like hydration, more, more common, I guess, in the industry. It's like, Back, even back then, a year and a half ago, it was only what like elite level athletes were drinking. Yeah.